Welcome back to my channel. Girl, we doing a haul. I've literally had so many clothes here for so long and I have been waiting to make this video. So now I have a million clothes. Do this. I'm gonna be here all day. Like by the time the sun starts going down, I'm still gonna be trying all these clothes on. And that's completely on me. I have three bags. Um, two of them are from Avalon Exchange and one of them is from Kohl's because Kohl's just had a huge sale and I'm so excited to show you guys what I got. Um, I haven't tried anything on, so this is my first impression. So let's just jump straight into it. Also, I do wanna say that my style is like always evolving, so I got some different things, but there's like a lot of neutrals in here. So um, we're gonna start with Kohl's, okay? We're gonna start with Kohl's, we're gonna start Tame. Um, hopefully, hopefully everything's okay. <laughs> Your girl's nervous, okay? Your girl is nervous. Starting in Kohl's. Hmm. So I got these Reese cups. I love Reese's. Like this is my favorite candy. Anyways, um, first grab amazing. We also got this little wine night kit, which was amazing. Like I'm so excited for this. So it has the wine night essentials. Um, so it has a corkscrew, wine removing towelettes, an aerator, a wine stop pour, a decision coin. So it, you flip it to say if you're gonna have like this is your last wine glass or if you're gonna keep pouring. So that's really exciting. Has two coasters, which is interesting. Um, a wine takeout, wait, a wine and takeout pairing guide. So that's very interesting to have. Um, I'm very curious to see what that looks like. And then this wine stain remover. I love this, especially because I'm about to have Galentine's at my house. Cute. Then we got these coasters. So they all have bees. There, I got four of them and they're all bees. And I love that. I think it just fits right into my house too. And that's all that I have that's not clothes. So let's get into the clothes. So next I got this sweater. It's like an off-white cream color sweater. It's um, Simply Vera by Vera Wang collection in um, Kohl's. And it's actually, it feels amazing. The only reason I got it, I felt it, I said, oh, oh, it feels like I'm on a cloud. Like this is just, it feels amazing. Like, oh my God, and it was on sale. Why would I not get it? Girl, okay, so I got this skirt and this was such a fluke. I got this for like $10. It's an Adidas, like I assume it's a golf skirt. It could be a tennis skirt, but girl, I'm gonna wear it either way. Especially because my job has so many like golf outings and it's such a good like This is perfect Girl don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. Don't mess with me. I love this. At least we got this jacket She's cute. She's presidential. That's what my mom kept calling. She said, okay, madam president Honestly though, like honestly, I just I don't know what I'd wear this with or where I'd wear it to, but as long as you got it in the closet, you know, she is too cute. I don't know. And it was so on sale. I got it for like 15. I got it literally for $15 and it was originally like 80. Anyways, one more thing. I got a doormat. It's already outside my door. And I was spending so much time getting a doormat because I read this thing about getting like a welcome mat and you should not have like a welcome mat, like a doormat that says welcome. Cause like a robber came into somebody's house and was like, oh, well I was welcome because the doormat said welcome. And I was like, oh, that's crazy. <laughs> I was like, that's insane. And I have been on the look on a prowl for a welcome mat that don't say welcome, but don't look ugly, you know? Like, but this one, it's okay. I think it just matches the inside fairly well. So I just, I just got it, you know, I just got it. Okay, let's go to Avalon Exchange. So these are two different purchases, two different weeks that I bought stuff and I left it in the bag because I didn't want to, like I literally wanted to make a video for this 
But then I said, I'm going to go again. And I went again. So I think this means that I need to take a break. I don't think I'm going to go back to Avalon for at least like two more weeks. Maybe three. Maybe a month. I need a break. I think I'm going to start going to my normal thrift stores again. I'm done with Avalon. I'm done with Avalon for the next month. If I go back to Avalon any time in February, all the way up to March like 5th or something like that, slap me. I don't care. Do whatever you want. Not during Black History Month, though. Don't do that. Slap me at the end of Black History Month. Slap me in March. Let's go with the first one. Honestly, I forgot what I got, so... This... This will be interesting. Let me just take everything out. Yes. Now we're gonna put this one first. I'm trying to com I'm trying to combine things first. Oh my sunglasses! I forgot, girl. I would have been pissed. Would have been mad. Let's not lose that. I am decided to try these on first. These are Zara pants, leather pants. I've always wanted leather pants like all my life. Granted, I wanted black ones. These are brown. But granted, I do want brown leather pants. I'm nervous. I'm very nervous. I've lost a lot of weight. I fluctuate. I do all of that. They still have the tags on. No one ever wore these pants. Why? It's, that's a little sketch, but it's also a really good thing. I don't know. Let's try it on. They also seem very long, but I'm a tall girly. I don't know. Size eight my ass. Like, what in the world is this? What is the... And I want to note that this wasn't me. But this... These aren't even on. They're not even on the same track, you know? Like, the zipper wasn't zippering regardless. I don't know. Because, girl, I wear a size six. I don't know. Well, that's interesting. Well, that changes the trajectory of this. Pants. Leather pants and me just don't key key. This is like the third or fourth pair of like leather pants that I've tried in my life that just don't fit me. Like, they just, like, every girl says like, oh, I love my leather pants. Leather pants, like, work, like, wonders on me. And I'm like, that just don't work for me. This is so different than something I'd normally get, and I actually really like this. Like, this is such like a, such like a girly thing. Like, <laughs> ding! And plus, so the reason I got this originally was because I was thinking I was going to be going, so I'm going to LA, and I was like, ooh, this is like such a cute winery moment. Like, I should be on a winery in this dress. And I don't know if it's giving winery, but it is giving... Uh, It's giving I deserve to be a wife. Like, that's what it does give. I can tell you that much. Like, that is what it gives. And I do. What can I say? Granted, it does look like I'm a... It does look like I'm a Mormon wife, though. And I'm not a Mormon wife. I'm very different than that. But, or maybe like a... Oh wait, is this backward? <laughs> it's really disgusting. And if this is supposed to clip, that's even worse. Okay, this is the most disgusting thing I've ever seen in my fucking life. This just turned so much worse. Like, I'm so sorry. I, I simply can't get behind this. Granted, I will be at church in this. I don't go to church, but I will go to someone's church in this. But I will go to someone's church with my shit out. Like, I don't got nothing, but I will, it will be out. Cause that, that was insane. What was that? So then I got this set. It's from Nasty Gal. This thing actually feels divine. Like, oh my God. I don't think I'm supposed to wear it all the way up though. This reminds me of a little like polo, like button up that I used to wear at church all the time that my mom used to make me wear. But I think that looks even weirder. I don't know, girls. I'm looking at a mirror, FYI. Oh, that doesn't look bad. 
That's cute. That's cute. I don't know what is with this entire color palette, but everything is white, off-white, brown, tan, neutral, all of that. I don't, I don't know. I don't know what to do with that. That's weird. Anyways, let's move on. So this shirt was honestly a steal. This shirt is from Rag and & Bone, and honestly, it was so cheap. Like, I'm shocked. And I'm obsessed with it. I think with a pair of like brown pants, honestly, I could have worn the leather pants if they fit, but that's the other point. I'm not bitter. I'm just saying, and I think that would have worked really well, but I'm very happy that they had this. Like, this is so cute and I'm very excited. I think I'm going to wear it with a pair of brown trousers that I got, I think, three weeks ago. Cute. But while I put this one, I'm going to talk about my rag and bone shirt. So I think I'm going to, when I become a, when, I'm going to keep saying when, when I become a corporate baddie, or maybe if, I don't know, if I become a corporate baddie, that is an outfit that I'd wear and I'd rock. Like, holy crap, that with a pair of brown trousers, the brown trousers that I'm referring to, holy shit. <laughs> it's so cute. I love this. I wanna be a beach bum. I wanna be a beach bum so freaking bad. No, but this is really cute. Not even as, not even just saying beach bum. Like, this is just like an outfit I could wear out. Like, I'd wear this outfit out. And I'd be very content. I love this. This feels amazing, FYI. And it's just like a very plain, I'm getting a lot of basics right now, if you guys can't tell. I have like no basics and I wear like so many like random clothes. Like I have so many random patterns in my freaking. Uh, oh, this is cute. Basic. I have so many random patterns in my freaking closet for what? Something that I'm just changing in my fashion sense since I'm like learning what fa fast fashion is and moving away from it. And blah, 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 you know what I mean? Because screw fast fashion. Granted, I'm wearing like Zara right now, but it's thrifted. It's not, I didn't, I did not search and say like, I only want Zara while I'm out thrifting. You know, it just so happened to be Zara. Anyways, actually, I don't even know if Zara is fast fashion. I don't really buy anything unless it's fairly good quality. I don't know. That seems fairly good quality. All right. I got this long black skirt. I've always... Can you see my toesies? I want you to see the full thing. So this is what I got. I've always wanted to be a long skirt girly. I have maybe three... I have one long skirt. I have maybe two medium skirts medium length skirts, I should say. And this is probably a long one, I'd say. My other long one is like all the way to the ground. Like, to the ground. So this is the next one that I have. And this is so cute. It's black too. I love that for me. And it has that slit. If it was just like fully, like all the way around, I don't think I would have bought it. But I think the slit just does it for me. Cause I, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna hike it up. If someone takes a picture of me. Hike. What? So this thing, I, oh my God, it has, <laughs> it has um, shoulder pads. That's so cute. Let's make sure the shoulder pads are in place. If we're gonna use them, we better use them right. Per. Per. Okay, honestly, this is kind of cute. I feel very much, como se dice, a flight attendant. And that's what it's gonna give. I don't know about the shoulder pads, girl, though. I don't know about them. What they look like without them. It don't even look like, I'm like, it don't even look like a difference. Boom, 
Okay. I don't know where I'm gonna wear it. I'm not really a blazer girl. I don't know why I bought two blazers in the matter of a week or the matter of the same day, actually. I bought the same day. And she was 50% off. And she was a petite. <laughs> so you think I'm skinny? We're winding down. So we got these bottoms. I don't know if they're sleep pants or not, but they are cute. I think they're see-through though. Let me check. Granted, I'm wearing dark blue underwear, so what did you expect? But they're cute. They're white. I think that okay, so they're from they're from Opali, and they still have tags on. I think that they're wedding, like pajamas, get ready, like I don't know. Hopefully everything went well, and they just work her size, and they just did not work out for her wedding day or something like that. I don't know. I'm wishing that on that girl. And if I'm, if they're not anything to do with the wedding, and I'm just projecting, like, thank you. They're cute. And they are just very cute pants. Or as pajamas. Who knows? I don't know. I may wear them out as pants. So if you see me out in these white ass, fucking satin, silk, flowy ass pants, don't say anything. I knew no, I knew nothing about it. The last thing that we had, the color was amazing. The fabric was stunning. <clears throat> you ruined it. Anyways, we have this thing. I think it's from Nasty Gal. Yeah, I don't know what it is with Nasty Gal and these Tampa girls, but they, they love Nasty Gal. But she is such a cute color. My mom loves the color green. I don't think she loves this color green, per se. I feel like there's a bug on me. Oh my god, I think it's just my hair. But. <laughs> I look... I don't know what I look like. But girl, you either look like you're about to go to sleep, or like a pajama party or something. I don't know what it is. I like this. This is so adorable. This is such a cute color. Let's see what it looks like. I'm gonna come close. I feel like, um, <laughs> I feel like Julie Andrews in, um, in Princess Diaries. I don't know why, but specifically her. I feel like the fucking queen. Y'all know I love this little look right here. And I'm going to play it out until the day I die. Like, this is cute. She's cute. I love this. I love this so much. But this is the last thing I got. And I love that I left it out with a bang. I'm obsessed. I didn't say this the entire time. And I think this is the perfect time for me to say it. Cause I'm obsessed. Are you guys obsessed? Cause I'm obsessed. <laughs> I look like one of those badass little kids in the middle of the night just trying to get some water. I hope you guys enjoyed my vlog. Vlog? My haul? My haul of like three different shopping trips because it was exhausting. It was exhausting to put all this stuff on, honestly. And I'm glad that we figured out that Leather pants just aren't for me. So if you guys like this, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. Remember to follow all my other channels because, because why not? I'm cool. I am cool. <laughs> I am so fucking cool. Anyways. I'm gonna go put all this stuff away and I'm gonna go style the rest of these outfits. I will see you guys later. Bye. I'm gonna go eat the rest of these Reese's.